every zone valve at its heart is just a relay and a relay is a simple device where two separate circuits go to that device without ever interacting with one another and when one circuit is activated some mechanical thing happens to activate the second circuit and these are the four wires we see coming out of our zone valve two yellow sometimes black wires for one circuit two red wires for the other our motor is part of what we call the control circuit. This is the control that decides when the boiler will fire up and when it shuts down, which is controlled by the thermostat. The end switch is part of the boiler circuit that actually carries out that command. So our 24 volts is going to leave the transformer. It's going to go to the R terminal on the thermostat. Now on the thermostat's W terminal, that is when heating is activated. So that wire is going to go to the zone valve motor. Um, it will then leave the motor and go back to the transformer, and this is the common wire. So when our thermostat calls for heat, it's going to close the switch between that R and W terminal, and that allows the 24 volts to leave the transformer, power the entire circuit, which activates the motor in the zone valve, and the motor is going to start spinning, pushing that gear down on the end switch button, and once that button is pushed in, the boiler fires up. 